What's up you guys, this is OGCP DeSilva and I'm playing a Modern Warfare 3 game of Team Deathmatch here on Lockdown using the CM901 Suppressed and quite frankly this isn't one of my favorite assault rifles to use. I find that whenever I use it I get a lot of hit markers and I find that it takes a lot more bullets to kill someone. That might be just my own personal preference but playing with it through level 31 I have found that that has been most of the case whenever I've played with it. Now I'm looking for the party and I'm... Discovering them here in this building looking through the windows and of course I'd find them there Why didn't I think of that before because in lockdown? There's just a lot of campers That's the reason why I don't really like this map at all and another map that I don't really like is downturn Those two maps make me rage the hardest because I find that they are poorly built They're very encouraging for the campers to camp on and there's just a lot of bad stuff that happens whenever I play those two maps if those two maps came up at the same time during the voting process, I would choose Lockdown over Downturn because I really do hate Downturn. I know I'm using hate because it's a strong word and I really do dislike Downturn that much. That's why I'm using hate because I usually don't use hate that much, but uh, I, I just had to pull it out for Downturn. But yeah, I mean the maps in general in Modern for 3 aren't so great. They were poorly built. I think they weren't really built for the gamers likes. I think Modern for 2 had some great maps such as High Rise and Rust and Terminal, Favela. The list goes on Dead Man's Hand. Okay. Look at that how big that explosion was. The regular C4s don't make a big of a explosion, but Dead Man's Hand C4s, they for some reason freaking go off like a bazooka. It's insane. It's like why? It doesn't make any sense. They're initially and practically the same thing their c4 is in the player's hands that they detonate and i don't know why one is more powerful than the other maybe because it's the death streak and you just die so much here's a host migration three two one where you are back i really don't know that's another stupid thing in this game that they just could have done away with was the crazy death streaks and i honestly didn't like the death streaks in modern warfare 2 and i don't like them here in Modern Warfare 3, they could have done a lot of stuff that could have improved the game and just made it a whole lot better experience. I was hoping for a lot more from this game. I was anticipating it. I was hoping that it was going to be the best Call of Duty ever, but apparently that did not happen. And you know, a lot of times when these developers are giving us updates and stuff, trying to improve the game now when it should have been done a while back, kind of makes me wonder what they were actually thinking, what they were actually doing behind the scenes once the game was underway. I was thinking that probably they were um, trying to compete with Battlefield 3 that's why they wanted to release it around the same time it was coming out so that's why it feels like an unfinished product but again that might just be my own opinion I don't know what's going on behind the scenes and who am I to judge and you know speculate about what's going on because I'm just a small YouTube commentator I have no idea what's going on in the bigger picture but again that's just the way I feel about it whenever I'm playing now, if you guys don't know my own playing style whenever I play games, as you guys can see, I'm never camping around, I'm never, you know, having a dull moment whenever I play. That's just my whole playing style is rush, 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 recklessly, run and gun style like Mark of J-ish. And um, I just hope to be as good as him one day because he's a beast. I mean, honestly, if you see someone's gameplays, him and Xcal, those guys are really, really good at rushing and getting some awesome gameplays for you guys. Um, if you guys are subscribed to them, to them, if you guys don't know who I'm talking about, check them out. They're really awesome. But uh, yeah, that's my whole playing style. Whenever I play first-person shooters, I've always been this way. I've always had the most fun while rushing. I just can't camp. And obviously, if you camp, you're a noob because that's not a way to play the game. That's just the cheap way of getting high kills and you know, basically waiting around for someone to come around and just picking them off. That's the easy way. Another way, another playing style besides rushing and camping is the one that's in between. It's a little better, is conservatively, but I just don't have as much fun playing with that. And oh my goodness, is that a MOB or a MOAB? I <laughs> have no idea how you guys want to pronounce it. But I got the mother of all bombs, a massive... Ordnance air bomb. I'm so happy. I thought this day would never come, but eventually it did. I just want to give a quick shout out to Get Her Done because he played with me in this game and actually did give me some moral support, even though he tried to mess me up by calling me a gypsy. But again, I had the most fun in this game. This was probably the most exciting and most defining point in my gaming of COD history career, and I was just so happy, so ecstatic. 
And yeah, I just want to thank Get Her Done again for being there to experience my first Moab and awesome, awesome time. This was just crazy. I mean, I was so ecstatic when I got this when the Moab popped up. But again, what can you do? Of course, if it's your first Moab, oh my goodness, I get my first death. But what can you do? It doesn't really matter. I got the Moab. There's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> Even though I didn't get the final kill cam, I was trying to get that with the 31 or 32 and oh I was trying to go flawless but what the heck that just hinders me because my playing style is not that way where I camp and just cautiously go up and about around people but hope you guys enjoyed and went 31 and 1 thank you for joining me thank you for watching and I got my Moab I'm so happy thank you guys once again and this is OGCP to so I'll see you guys next time and I am signing off